My name is Madison Sharon and I'm from sixth grade and this is my science project. So my question was, um, how much bacteria can you wash off of your hands with different amounts of water, different temperatures of water? Like 70 degrees Fahrenheit, 85 degrees Fahrenheit, and 100 degrees Fahrenheit. My hypothesis was that um, 85 degrees Fahrenheit would work the best because 100, because 100 degrees Fahrenheit would wash off um, too many cells that I could damage your hands and um, 70 degrees Fahrenheit wouldn't wash off enough bacteria. So, um, my variables were, my control variable was my hands washed, so I um, just took a swab, um, dipped it in purified water and swabbed my hands and glided it across a, um, a gauntlet. And then my independent variable was the temperature of the water, my dependent variable was how much bacteria grow. So for my research, I um, researched in two websites, infodegroup.com, which um, infodegroup.com said the hotter water does cut through oil on your hands faster, so they may feel cleaner, but extremely hot water can also damage skin, making it more susceptible to colonization by bacteria, which it is then harder to remove from your hands. I also studied BerkeleyWellness.com, which said colder water works best because it washes more bacteria. No, it says it washes more bacteria off than hot water. So they had pretty similar ideas. And then my materials, I used a guard plate, nine uncontaminated Q-tips, um, an infrared thermometer to measure the water, what temperature it was at, purified water, and antibacterial soap. Um, for my procedure, I basically just kind of like took a guard plates out, I got, I measured the water temperature, and then I washed my hands with antibacterial soap normally, and then my brother swabbed my hands to help me with it, and I also, we, I did that three times with all temperatures, which was my brother and my dad. So we had nine results. And then, so, the results were that 70 degrees Fahrenheit had the least bacteria on the arc agar plates. 100 degrees Fahrenheit had the most bacteria on the agar plates, and 85 degrees Fahrenheit was in between both of those temperatures. So in conclusion, to get the most amount of bacteria off your hands, you should use 70 degrees Fahrenheit. My, my hypothesis was incorrect. I thought that 85 degrees Fahrenheit would wash off the most amount of bacteria. I learned that the hotter the water, the more bacteria gets left on your hands. So I have three pictures, all of them are 100 degrees Fahrenheit, from section one of the test, section two, and section three. And then I also have a table with everything right there. And I also have a graph. So thank you for um, your time and the opportunity to do this.